Meghan hinders Harry from backing to UK for Diana party as scare of losing face after missing throne. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry will not be returning to the UK this month for a party to honor the Duke's late mother. Rumors that Harry and Meghan could return to the UK this month began circulating on Saturday after a report by The Sun speculated on the likelihood of a return trip. However, a spokeswoman for the Duke and Duchess of Sussex has now confirmed to the Telegraph the royal couple will not be in attendance at the upcoming event. It was always believed Harry would return for the hour-long celebration when it was arranged. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle will not be flying back to the UK for a party in honor of Princess Diana, it is claimed. Around 100 people are expected to attend the bash at Kensington Palace, with Diana's old friend Sir Elton John said to be on the guest list. But a spokeswoman for the Duke and Duchess of Sussex confirmed the couple will not be present, the Daily Telegraph reports. The celebration has been organized to thank donors for funding a commemorative statue of Diana which now sits in Kensington Palace's sunken garden. Prince William and his brother Harry appeared to be on good terms as they unveiled the statue, with the pair smiling and chatting throughout the day. In addition, the trip from the US would have been made easier as travel restrictions have now been lifted, meaning the couple could have been spared from quarantine. It is not known whether the prince will return at all this year as he and his wife focus on further establishing their Archul Foundation, Spotify podcast and Netflix documentaries in the US. The party to be held at Kensington Palace a week on Tuesday will see around 100 guests, including friends of the late Princess Diana such as Elton John, join the Duke of Cambridge as a special thank you. Friends, former staff, relatives and other donors who helped fund the statue of Princess Diana, unveiled on July 1st, are expected to receive special praise for their help in bringing the project to life. The statue of William and Harry's mother was unveiled by the royal brothers this summer in a small ceremony on what would have been their mother's 60th birthday. In a joint statement made at the time, the brothers said, Today, on what would have been our mother's 60th birthday, we remember her love, strength and character, qualities that made her a force for good around the world, changing countless lives for the better. Every day, we wish she was still with us and our hope is that this statue will be seen forever as a symbol of her life and her legacy. Thank you to Ian Rank Broadley, Pip Morrison and their teams for their outstanding work, to the friends and donors who helped make this happen, and to all those around the world who keep our mother's memory alive. The events this year had to be drastically scaled down due to the ongoing Covid pandemic with the party postponed and the statue unveiling itself seeing just a fraction of the planned turnout, instead taking place in front of just a small number of her closest circle. The statue of Princess Diana at the Sunken Garden depicts the late Princess of Wales at a period of her life as she gained confidence in her role as an ambassador for humanitarian causes. Prince Harry is also not expected to return to the UK for Remembrance Day as is scheduled to return to New York. His return to NYC will see the Duke present the inaugural Intrepid Valor Awards to veterans and military families living with the invisible wounds of war. At the unveiling of the statue in July, the brothers were understood to have come to an unspoken agreement to put their feud behind them and make the day about their late mother. The Duke of Cambridge is expected to attend the party for the sponsors of the statue on October 19. It was previously reported that royal aides were preparing for Meghan and Harry to make a surprise return for the bash. But a spokeswoman for the couple has now confirmed they will not be returning for the party. Confirmed.